for Academy time. Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a quest in the Academy. Visit other houses to get decoration inspiration. Welcome back! The other music students and I just finished making our own drums. We're having so much fun learning to play. Nothing beats a drum when it comes to keeping the rhythm. Would you like to make a drum too? So now we're gonna have a drum as well. Guitar and a drum. That's Great! A Let's rock and roll! I have a spare drum shell and the rest of the parts, but it needs a new drum head. Some people also call it a drum skin. Groundskeeper Wilkes made one for me earlier. Speak to him about making you a new one. I'll go speak with him. I'm guessing you don't think you like it. Like kind of how it did with the the guitar, like the remote, I guess. So I guess you'll like place them with the drum. Howdy! Looks, Looks like, like you're, you're making, making a drum. drum. I, I can, can see that it needs a new drum head. You have I can make, I can make one, one while you go to a kiosk and read the books, musical instruments around the world, and let's make some music. Also, go find two pieces of wood so that I can make drumsticks for you. Come back after you're done. Instruments around the world. Jesus. Musical instruments around the world. In every country around the world, music brings people together. Musicians gather together to play music on instruments, and people gather together to hear their music. Musical instruments come in all shapes and sizes, and they can be divided into three groups based on how you play them. Percussion instruments, wind instruments, and stringed instruments. Here are some percussion... Here are some percussion, wind, and stringed instruments you may already know about. Maybe you've seen or heard them at home, at school, in a band, or in a parade. Now let's take a trip around the world to look at some musical instruments that might be new to you. Percussion instruments. In Asia, people have been playing gongs for thousands of years. A gong makes a long ringing tone, which sounds a little like a loud bell. It's fun to bang a gong. Other percussion instruments can make different sounds. 
The kalimba is from South Africa. When you pluck the pegs of a kalimba with your thumbs, each peg makes a different sound, just like the keys on a piano. That's why the kalimba is also called a thumb piano. A kalimba. Some Native Americans in North America shake rattles during dances. Each rattle is hollow and filled with seeds, rocks, or shells. Shaking the rattle makes sound as the pieces inside of it move around. Wind instruments. Wind instruments make sounds when you blow air through them. Panpipes are played in Peru and many other South American countries. Panpipes are made from bamboo tubes of different lengths. Each hollow tube makes a different sound when you blow across the pipes. Australia's most famous wind instrument is the didgeridoo. The didgeridoo is a long wooden tube that's usually made out of a young tree trunk. Didgeridoo players make their lips vibrate while they blow into the hollow tube. A didgeridoo player can make many different low sounds this way. Another long wind instrument is the albinhorn. It originally came from the country of Switzerland in Europe. In the past, animal herders used the alpenhorn to communicate with each other across the valleys of the Alps mountain range. Now, alpenhorns are played mainly at festivals and other events. instruments, the bagpipe is one of the most unusual looking. The Scottish bagpipe is from the European country of Scotland. A bagpipe player blows air into a bag that has four pipes coming out of it. Three pipes each make a single note. The fourth pipe has a row of holes in it, which make different sounds when the player covers them with his or her fingers. Stringed instruments. Stringed instruments make sounds when you pluck, strum, or rub their strings. The sitar is a stringed instrument from the Asian country of India. The word sitar means three strings, but a sitar can actually have as many as 20 strings. Musicians usually play the sitar sitting on a small platform or even on the floor. Sometimes musicians play stringed instruments using only their fingers. Other times, they also use something else, like a guitar pick or a violin bow. The Japanese samisen is played with a bachi. A samisen has only three strings, but it can make many different sounds. Greek musicians usually play the bouzouki with their fingers and a pick. Although it is played like a guitar, the bouzouki has eight strings, not six. When musicians play percussion instruments, wind instruments, and stringed instruments, the music they create can make the world seem brighter and more colorful. It's no wonder that people like listening to all kinds of music all over the world. There we go. Then we need music. For let's make some music. Okay. Let's make some Jane, Abby, Sarah, 
Nick and Adam had a plan. They would make a band. We can make our instruments, said Jane. What do you mean? asked Nick. I'll show you, said Jane. Jane got two pots and flipped them over. We can use pots for drums, said Jane. Oh, I get it now, Nick said. Let's all look for things to make music with, Sarah said. Nick looked to see what he could find. Look, drumsticks, he said. He gave them to Jane. Bam, bam, bam! Let's use the pot lids too, said Adam. Clang, clang, clang! Nick looked by the sink. He saw a few clean bottles. Nick blew over the top of one. Sarah got a bottle too. She put dry beans in it. Then she put the cap on tight. Shake, shake, shake. Jane saw Abby looking sad. Are you okay? Jane asked. I couldn't find an instrument, Abby said. Why don't you clap, said Jane. Your hands can be great instruments. Abby smiled a big smile. Now she could play in the band too. Clap, clap, clap. Let's try playing all of our instruments at the same time, said Jane. Yeah, said Nick. Let's make some music. Bam, bam, bam. Clang.
for any Thanks for reading those books. Great day, and I'll see you guys next time.